do I do I run? just getting ready to go i was getting ready to leave i mean oh! what's up everybody it's your girl golden jade and we are back with ignited entry it's another horror game i have no idea what this is about um it's starting to become a pattern at this point that i don't know what these games are about i don't know if i should start looking these up and learning about them before i start recording or if it should just be a surprise whenever we do play them let me know what you think. Um, but anyways, let's just get into this game. Oh. He was a fireman, bold and true. Until one night, the flames withdrew. Oh, what is this, a point? A mother and son lost to the blaze. Their lives cut short in a fiery haze. Snap it up, snap it up, that's a bar. The father saw the firemen arrive, but ran in first, too fearful of time. Through smoke and flame, he couldn't stay. The firemen pulled him and rushed him away. I like reading this. <laughs> The father passed, his family gone. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, and the fireman's guilt will linger on. He left the job, tried to stand tall. But the silence broke with a sudden phone call. Music. Hey, who's this? Hey, it's your brother, Jason. I have a brother? Hey, Jason, long time no see. How have you been? Yeah, it's been a while. I've been busy. Yeah, I noticed. I haven't heard from you in months. What's going on? Look, I don't really have time for small talk right now. I need a favor. You called me! Oh, because you need a favor. <laughs> That's only why you call. Oh, okay. I'm moving What's out, up? and I need some help. Thought maybe my dear brother could spare a few hours. I'm a brother? You could have given me some heads up. Why now all of a Life sudden? Life happens, all right? Look, I don't need to explain myself to you. Can you you asking me for help? Well, I guess not. Well, Great. I guess I can. I'll meet you outside in five minutes. Oh. You ain't even give me no time to put some, some drawers on? No, no nothing. So, how have you been? Fine. Nothing special has been going on, really. Just the same old routine, I guess. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. What, you got a grandfather clock in here? Probably just a church bell or something. There's nothing. I see anyway, nothing. Are you still looking for a new job? Uh, oh, I didn't know. My dear brother, you are hideous! What do I look like? I have no legs! Uh, uh, my dear brother, I think we're dead. Put, put this thing over! Oh, baby, no. Oh, no. Are you going to pull over? Now, brother, I, I will take this wheel. What? Why would you bring me back here? The sound is coming from inside the house. Uh, then uh, we not, we shouldn't. We? Sure, I guess. Is this why you brought me here? Uh, I don't have no flashlight, no nothing. Oh, oh, 
Okay, I thought that was a ghost. Read note. What did it say? We remember the symbol. All of that in the background, all that text says we remember the symbol. What does the symbol mean? I'm Intro? What, what, what you, brother? What you doing, brother? Dear brother, what you running off? And then you just gonna you robbed me. You jacked me for my wallet, some brother. We're supposed to be- we're supposed to be family! What you doing robbing me? <laughs> he drew a symbol on me! Oh, he made me a sacrifice. Cut! He didn't draw it on me, he cut it into me! Oh... Find Jason. No, leave Jason in here! He cut me up, he robbed me, and then he ran into the house! What do I need to find my brother for? Okay, a bloody door. Holding that note. Why is it repeat? He held that note. I'm not reset. Hey, bro. Are we dead? Ding ding. Ah! Hello and welcome to My name is Steve, and I will be your personal AI assistant for today. Why are you Before we begin, an identification scan will be needed to identify the cause of your death. I'm dead! Please stand still. It's blank in my database, which means you are still alive. Wait, what? Can you recall what brought you here? My brother did. There's another fellow who goes by the name Brother Jason, who checked in a few minutes ago. You two have matching DNA. Well, that, I mean, that's my brother. But before you go, I'm required to try you with the this is oh, those are like the glasses I have on right now. By pairing it with a memory orb in order to counteract insanity. What? I would advise you to stick to your own memory orbs. Unless you like peeking into other people's memories. Anyways, you will now be transferred to... You can't even tell me. Shut up! Hello. Welcome aboard on the visit to Glide. You are currently being transported to the aftergrave of your inviter. You will arrive shortly. This would be peaceful if this ugly, hideous monstrosity of a picture wasn't, um, boogers. No? Okay, uh. No, okay, uh.
okay, so this is Emily's point of view. Laundromat again. Her dryer's too small for this guest room load. Hey, babe, quick question. Did you happen to change the computer password? Oh, yeah, I did, actually. I meant to tell you, but it completely slipped my mind. No worries. It happens to the best of us. Why the change, though? Well, our little tech whiz of a son has been spending more time on the computer than on his schoolwork lately. So I thought a little password change might redirect his attention. Ah, sneaky move. So where's the new hiding spot for the password this time? Behind the dryer in the utility room. Okay. <laughs> Figured it would be a safe bet. Remember Got that. It. Behind Thanks the dryer. Keep things in check, darling. Anything for our little troublemaker, right? Exactly. That one. Why on an old piece of paper? Chase Turner, 15. Okay. Uh, sure. Everything just got darker. Why? What was that? Uh, okay, and then that changed. Um, yeah. This folder is locked to open the folder. A few security. A few security questions need to be answered. Do you wish? Yeah. Uh, no. Uh, yes. Uh, yes. Uh, uh, like, are these right answers? <laughs> yeah. N no? Okay, uh, 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 who, do, do I have to, okay, uh, okay, careful, please don't, and now the camera's gone, uh, or is it still right there, no, it's still right there, it's just greatly hidden, um, okay, if I turn around real slowly, is it gonna pop, okay. Was this the... No, it was this door that was... Ah! Okay, well, whatever it is, we don't need a key for it. It's just gonna have to stay in there. Hide where? Okay, hide, hide! Location, uh, Chase's zone. Oh, what the heck are you doing, Jason? Stop, fo stop following you! You brought me here! Now don't let nothing pop out. Ooh! Well, he's going to be stuck on the elevator, not me. Oh, food. Pork chunkies. Bro, what? Okay, and then what is that? Thirsty beans? Pork chunkies? And then what? what is this? Thirsty beans? Or tasty beans? Tasty beans. Um, oh. Here I am looking at the food. Oh, it's another memory. 
Okay, chase his eyes. Okay. Oh, the arcade game. If we win this game of Pong, we should have enough tokens for the main prize. All right. Who's going first? I'll take care of this one. Don't tell me I gotta beat this game in order to go to the next. How, how many do, how do I beat Chase? It gets faster. I, I, I'm whooping you. Grab fuse. Um. Oh, fuses for this. I have the breaker key. But uh, who coming closer? Who? You got me. Who coming closer? Please open. Uh, please. You want to open up this elevator? Not going nowhere. Um. Okay, stop. Don't, don't scare me again. Just come out normally. Uh, sir? Just walk out normally, please. Don't. Ah! You should have seen the look on your face. You absolute What you call me? I have been sent over to inform you that an individual from another afterdrape has requested a visitor call with your name on it. <laughs> Isn't that exciting? I have sparked a phone for you to use. A bit further into the rooms. Future oh. policy! We only allow a certain amount of phone time between visitors and the dead. So, make it quick. Ta-ta! <laughs> the uh okay. Um Hey, you don't know me that well. But I know you. I'm not allowed to speak to the visitor phone for too long, so listen very closely. You need to keep moving forward. Eventually, you will find the aftergrave exit. Pass through it, and you will be safe from them. From there, I've arranged the visitor's wife to come pick you up and take you to my location. 
Ability to dissolve anything bearing the symbol. Now, why is it eerily quiet? Yeah. Okay. Oh. Cool. Do I do I run? Ah! I was just getting ready to go. I was getting ready to leave. I mean, oh! Oh! the gas pumps before I can power the generator. Oh, goodness. Now, if Miss Lady gonna pop out, um, keep matches hidden to a. I can follow this. I should be okay. No? Oh, I'm, I'm looking at a wall. There's a door right here. Okay. So, so now what? So, now what? Do I just get on up out of here? into existence.
Looks like there actually is an afterlife. It may be just isn't what I expected it to be. Me and Chase have been assigned to this thing called an aftergrave. You! From what I've understood, it's an extension of the place you were at when you died. We both got killed in our home, so that explains the enormous house at least. I hope William is going okay without me and Chase. I miss him so much. The bone scars still haven't gone away. I don't recognize my little boy's beautiful face. And he doesn't recognize mine either. I can still see the skin peeling from his flesh. But that's okay. I just hope he can still look at my face and recognize me as his mother. The receptionist showed me the way to invite people into my aftergrave by using their DNA. I don't know the name of the man who sent it, but he left his matchbox in the house after he killed us. And I think I found it in the brother! Jason! Jason killed and then we tried to put out if you've gotten far enough to find the key to my diary, then you're probably the person I'm writing this to. I don't know your name. I don't know why you did what you did. But I do remember that symbol. He put it on... It's the only thing that I saw. And it's the only thing I won't forget. He cut it into me to make it... Oh, Jason is a jerk. What kind of brother? Oh, okay. Jason carved it onto us because he doesn't want to face it. Oh, he was a part of a, a what? Oh, no. Let's begin. Can I find the code through? One equals seven. One equals seven. Oh, one is seven, two is four, and then what is three? Uh. Seven to four. By the time I get to it, I'm gonna forget. Seven to four. Nine. Oh, oh well. Wow. Um, y'all are probably screaming at me in the comments. I'm sorry. Maybe what is this? The gate will open with a touch when inviters' handprints mean so much. This is too much.
No way. No way. Are you kidding me? Bro, I, wh why? You telling me? Look at how you got to drop him off at the... No, I feel like I should leave you up in there. You're not finished uh, baking. You're not cooked thoroughly. You still, you still making noise. Now, if you jump scare me, you going back in there, and I'm turning this thing on. run through here because I don't know if I needed to run or not. My heart is beating. Oh, no. Don't let it be the reception. Oh. Probably know the truth by now. Brother. Only one of us is allowed to exit this place. And it's gonna be me! You an imposter! The devil will kill you before you make it to the visitor station. Uh, yeah. Sure. But don't worry, brother. What kind of brother is this that will sacrifice his own brother? Okay, but it looks like we made it though. Okay. Well, it look like we're the first ones here. What you mean? What do you mean? Yo! Yo! I can't get through! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Um, 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 let me go! You got- Okay. But I'm- I'm not the- I'm not the one that you are looking for! symbol on his arm. The man who killed us had the same one. He's the one who killed us. <laughs> well, an individual who goes by the name William Turner. That's to me that he was the fireman who was trying to save you two. Wait. What? So that would mean that his brother is the one who killed you. He's got a real tattoo on his arm. And this little tootsie roll just seems to have gotten a conveniently shaped scratch. <laughs> I'm a tootsie roll? <laughs> <laughs> Damn. What's going on? Is William here too? Was this poor guy uh, trying to save us? Is his brother still here? I uh, forget I ever said anything. No, you let you the have to you tell let me. the wrong one out. I mean, stop what? that. I don't know what you're talking about, but it looks like you two have passed outside of your aftergrave borders. 
And that means I have to send you back to your aftergrave. Ta-ta! Tell him that we're so So I'm free? Am I free? Did I make it? Did I make it? Yeah, who are you? Don't you remember me? No. Well then, let me refresh your memory. No. William's eyes. Wait. Okay, so this is the firefighter. Rescue my Is that Jason? That's Jason. Why did you want me to come here? Because you're our only hope. For what? This world is like a threshold to the afterlife, a waiting area where we need to find peace with our demise before we can cross over into the true afterlife, leaving our limbo state behind. What do you want me to do? If you avenge us, we can cross over into the true afterlife. I don't have nothing to do with this. I will be with my family again. I mean, I understand, but... Please! Okay, all right. Help us before it's too late. All right, all right, help all right. Yourself before it's too late. William, I said okay. Yeah, what do you mean by that? Let me just show you. Your brother is on his way to leave this world through the visitor exit as we speak. You sitting here talking to me? It only opens for one visitor per invitation. If he passes through, it will close. Okay, now, let me go. Stop talking to me. I got it. Ring, ring the bell. Come on. Ring the bell when you're ready, and you'll be teleported. By the time you get done with this sentence, my brother gonna be hey, gone, and I'm gonna be stuck here. Don't look down on yourself because you couldn't save us back in the fire. I'm trying to get out of here. Because you're saving all of us. Okay, bye. Ring, ring. Look. It's time to pack up your things. Oh. How can I help you today? Uh, we're not besties. Well, I'm only allowed to transport people to half the grave. I look in trouble if I transport you to the next. Oh, 
Weez? I'm Weez. It's a bloodied heart. Three, 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 three will open the hatch for overlocking mode, overclocking mode. You can over, you can only, godly, you can only overclock one core at a time. All three cords are overclocked simultaneously. The system will be overstimulated and the teleportation system. But I would like. We're gonna get it Extreme caution. Now, how do I avenge them is the question. What, what do I do from here? Do, oh, I set him on fire. Yeah. Everybody free? So he ended up dying too? What? How sweet. <gasps> that was that was actually pretty well. Pretty pretty well designed, pretty well um voice acting. Uh my favorite character, even though he pissed me off, was a receptionist. I'm not even gonna lie. But anyways, you guys, I hope you enjoyed today's gameplay. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button to become a part of the Golden Gang! And I better see you here in the next video. And as always, I love you guys. Take care of yourselves. Be good to yourselves. Take care of your mental health. And I will see you in the next gameplay. Deuce, deuce.